Starting it in Skybet League 2 is Barrel taking on Carlisle in this coming well tomorrow in the Skybet League 2. So, what's up, guys, and welcome back to another video on the channel by me, Barrel and Talk. Yes, I'm back with another video on the channel. In today's video, then, is a match preview for Barrel's home fixture at Holker Street taking on Carlisle. It is Derby Day, then, North Cumbrian Derby. Well, the Cumbrian Derby, who will be victorious. In the reverse fixture day, it was Carlisle that did beat us uh, two, I think it was 2-1 away from home. I could be wrong, but yeah, before we do get any further into this match preview, please don't forget to drop a like and subscribe to the channel. It would be massively appreciated for And you know what we do in these match previews from now. We go through form for either side, my predicted lineup, my score prediction and update on the Skybet League 2 table. So let's get into the first category and speaking about Form for either side coming into this tie. So yeah, Barrow's form coming into this, coming into this game. Then so from the 27th of March, we got a 2-1 loss against Stevenage. A uh, a 2-1 win, a 2-1 win against uh, Newport County, and a 1-1 draw against Colchester on the 5th of March. So a loss, a win, and a draw. Bit of mixed form then coming into this game, but hopefully we can. Uh, Show character, resilience, and uh, and uh, try and get a three points here against Carlisle. We need it now. A big, big push for the end of the season. Just uh, a, a big push is needed from and from us until the end of the season to keep to keep in the Skybet League too. But the net, well, the, still saying in this category, boy, it will be form for Carlisle coming into this tie. So, yeah, Carlisle and Form coming into this game. They're coming into this game with three wins on the bounce. A 2 0 win against uh, Crawley Town, a 2 0 win against South End, and a 2 2 0 win against Stunthorpe. So, it's going to be a very, very tight game. Three wins on the bounce for Carlisle. So, hopefully, we can there. Uh, hopefully, Barrow can there. Uh, defend. Well, try and uh, turn that around. We'll turn that into a uh, bad run of form. But, cut. Uh, but yeah, the next carry then I am going to speak about in this match preview is my predicted lineup. So yeah, my predicted lineup then coming into this game, I think we're gonna we're not we might make a bit of a bit of changes, but I think it'll be a three-five-two in Joel Dixon goal, a back three of James Jones, Bobby Thomas, and Patrick Brook. Right wing back in there, Brad Barry, left wing back in there, Josh K. Two holding midfields in Jason Taylor and Jason Taylor and uh, Oliver Banks. Just behind them in uh, Jamie Dever and then up front duo in Scott Quibby and Luke James. I think I think that'll be the lineup that we could that we will uh, play against Carlisle. I think that'll be a very very good lineup. Uh, both with uh, both Pacey down the wings, down the flank, but we just need to be more. Creativity in the midfield. I think maybe we could switch out uh, Banks for Chris Taylor uh, because Banks has just not been not been on the best of form recently. But you never know; he could turn up in this game and it could be an absolute madness if he was to uh, start. But the next category then is the most important category: is my score prediction. So yeah, the most important category that you all like to hear is my score. Pitching. My score pitch and then coming into this game, I think it will be a very, very tight and narrow game, but it won't be a very, very high scoring game in my opinion. I think it will be Barrow 2, Carl United 1. I think Barrow will go and get three points at Holker Street. We've been on some good run of form at Holker Street, so hopefully we can do go and get a, a, a three points against Carlisle. But yeah, the final category then of this match preview is an update of the Skybet League 2 table. So an update then on the Skybet League table, the final category of this match preview then. So still sitting top of the table is Cambridge United, two points behind Cheltenham. Cheltenham sitting in second, 
third in uh, Tramia, four in Bolton, still on level points, Tramia and Bolton. Fifth, Morecambe, just one point behind uh, Bolton and Tramia. Uh, Forest Green, sixth, only uh, a point behind Morecambe. Uh, seventh in Newport, they play tonight against uh, against Mansfield, so they could potentially move up to uh, fifth in after this game. Eighth in uh, fifth is, uh, in Exeter. Ninth, Carlisle, the game that we play there on Exeter and Carlisle on level points. Then let's move down to the bottom half of the table then. So you've got Mansfield playing today against uh, Newport County at six o'clock. Then you've got Oldham versus Colchester. So we need Oldham to beat Colchester and Colchester only one point behind us. So at the bottom half is Barrow 21st, Colchester 22nd, South End 23rd and 24th in Grimsby. So hopefully, hopefully, yeah, uh, we could potentially get three points and move up to the uh, up the table. But nothing else that I really want to say in this match preview, apart from Barrow needs to go and get three points. We need to uh, hope, but we need to battle it out now until the end of the season. Keep picking up as many three points as we possibly can. But yeah, nothing else that I'm going to say. But hopefully you have enjoyed this video. If you have, you know what to do: smash the like on the video and subscribe. So I'll be massively appreciated. Good. And all the Bluebirds, once again, me and my brother will be live at 2.45 for this big game, Derby Day. So, yeah, thank you for watching and peace.